What's up guys, Jason here, back again down in the nerd lair. I'm jumping right into eBay sales, here we go. Getting us started here, I sold an original Xbox game. It's gonna be Unreal 2 Awakening. Just got it somewhere back here, looks like it's on top of the stack. This is a new sealed Xbox game. Funny story about this, I purchased this back in 2004. There was an FYE or some sort of other big CD store going out of business at the mall in Louisiana. I bought a bunch of copies of this for $150 each, which at the time was an outrageous deal. I wind up trading a few back in the day. I still have a sealed copy in my personal collection. This sold for $16 total. This game is super heavy. This is probably coming in at over 11 ounces. Next up, I sold three used baby bottles, which is something I didn't foresee myself ever selling. Got them right here at the top here. This is something that can still be used. I've only used them for about four and a half months. They're a little smoggy, but they're still in really nice condition. These sold for $20 total. Not too heavy to ship, but it is gonna go in priority mail. Continuing on here, I sold a Michelangelo Ninja Turtles action figure. Still got a pretty big stack here on the bottom. And he sold for $11 total, free shipping. Got a couple left of him and a bunch of other ones. Sold a pair of women's shoes, which I don't sell very often, but my wife had cleaned out her closet and I listed a few pairs. Got them all right here. They're all pretty low value shoes. This pair is gonna be Cole Han. They sold for $18 total, free shipping. The others are all up now. Gonna get these packed up and ready to go. I'm actually out of tape, so I'm just trying to fashion this box. Gonna wrap it around with an old poly bag. Sold a high value item from this last bulk lot. It's these four dog plushies. I'm really surprised they were worth this much. I have them right up here and it's gonna leave a pretty big gap in the store, I think. This is just a Target brand. They retailed for $14.99. Sorry, that's not zooming in. I never thought they were rare or hard to come by or sought after at all. So I'm, like I said, really surprised they went for so much. Just gonna stack these up over here. So these sold for $84, getting a huge chunk back out of this bulk order I did a couple months ago now. Got the box right here ready to go. Free shipping, it only cost $8.50 to ship. In other news, the person who won the auction of this has not paid, it was only $10.50. I messaged them a couple times, no response. I'm just gonna have to go ahead and cancel that order and relist those and hope I can make about the same back on them. Guys, my assistant might be a little upset with me next time she comes in. She comes in to water this plant here and I was supposed to be doing it for a few days, but it is starting to turn brown. There's some sort of orange leaves on it. It does look bone dry. Let me water this. Just gonna fill it up to the brim. All right, that should be good. Had a few sales come through on Friday night. First up is gonna be a Poke Walker, which came packed in with Pokemon Heart Gold, Soul Silver back in 2010. Got it right here in this little baggie, just gonna leave it in this. It sold for $43 total, free shipping. I have this left over from 2010 when I was purchasing the Walmart exclusive of the two games. That has gone on to become extremely rare, very expensive. Last time I looked, I think that was selling for over $500 new and sealed. I don't regret selling my games at the time because I had no way of knowing it would become so super rare and I was still clearing a bunch of money on it. But I do regret not keeping one for myself. I think that's something I probably should have done, something I was already doing in that time frame anyway. I'm not sure why I didn't keep it. But like I said, this was left over from those. Sold for 43 bucks, super light to ship. So two more Ninja Turtles figures. These are both gonna be Leonardo. Went to the same buyer. He lives here in Colorado, so shipping is gonna be a little cheap. Got 
two right here. I should have two more after these. Took a best offer of $20 total, free shipping. Very nice toys. Gonna get these packed up and ready to go now. Just sold another PS3 single game. It's gonna be God of War 3, not for resale edition in a cardboard sleeve. Still got a bunch of these. I'm just sifting through and make sure I grab God of War 3. There we go. It went for $12 total. I'm gonna put this in between two pieces of cardboard and I'm still gonna ship it at three ounces. Like I said, I have a bunch of these left. They're selling fast enough, I think. Sold two common items that I seem to sell in every video, so I won't say much about them here. But it's gonna be a whoopsie cushion that sold for $6.85 and a World War II handwritten letter that sold for $5.40, getting these shipped right now. Just sold a Pokemon game for the Nintendo Game Boy. Got it right here. It came out of my personal collection, but I don't recall picking this up. I might have got it from a thrift store years ago, but without the box or manual, I don't really need to keep cartridge only games. This sold for $21 total, free shipping, super light. Getting this packed up and ready to go now. And finally, for my last sale of the week, you guys may remember when I purchased these NECA figures from Ninja Turtles. Bebop and Rocksteady. Well, I sold the empty box from these two toys. Yes, that's correct, an empty box. It's right down here on this second to the bottom shelf. It was listed for probably less than two weeks. I got $25 for this. You might be wondering why someone would purchase an empty box. There's a few different reasons. Collectors need these because a lot of resellers are selling the figure separately. Of course, two came in one pack. So people are buying them separately. And then also people can make custom figures and put them in this box. There's a pretty, pretty big market for NECA custom figures, 25 bucks. So that was the video guys. Hit that thumbs up button on the way out. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already and I'll see you next time, bye.